When most of us are driving down the highway and we see a sign that says lanes narrow, we don't think much of it. But if you're an over the highway trucker, like on I-80 behind me, uh, normal lane is about 12 feet wide. And on this bridge project, the contractor needed to make those lanes a little bit narrower. So when you go from 12 to 10 feet and you're a trucker, that's a big deal. So in this case, uh, what we are doing is providing advanced warning to vehicles that are over width. And we're doing that using LIDAR detection. So 22 miles from here, we give the truckers their first warning. If they're over 10 feet wide, they need to use an alternate route. Okay, so if they blow past that electronic sign and they're still over width, to use LIDAR to detect the width, we can even detect height, instantly creating a 3D image of that uh, truck. And then if the certain conditions are met, they're over width, we're instantly communicating that to our message boards to tell that trucker, hey, last chance, get off at this exit. Otherwise you're gonna approach this bridge. If you're 12 feet wide, you're coming through this 10 foot wide section, you could injure workers, you're gonna damage your load, it's gonna delay the project, and like I said, it could be absolutely catastrophic depending upon what's going on on this bridge. So we think this is the first of its kind, LIDAR used on a very temporary basis to create a, a safer work zone. We're extremely excited about it. You know, most of the time when you're using LIDAR, you have the luxury of going back to your office and analyzing the 3D models that were created, but in this case, we are creating those 3D images of the vehicles in real time. And then within a matter of seconds, if the certain conditions are met over width, we are telling that message sign to tell the trucker that they need to exit immediately. We can also integrate this to DOT systems, uh, in cab trucker communication systems. So they get that audible alert. Just another example of the many job specific safety solutions that the Street Smart team has been deploying for over 30 years. A lot of hard work went into this. The Iowa DOT was heavily involved. Um, our suppliers helping us get these sensors out here, getting them installed, uh, testing the data. Again, all to create a safer work zone, both for the truckers, for the workers out on this bridge, and for the motorists.